brothers and sisters, good to see you again here. I'm Lily with Zimmerman, the Jesus Christ Love and Care Ministry. I hope everybody's are doing well and good to see you again here, mga kapatid. Uh, today, I would like to share you uh, the another encouragement, a short message. It's about uh, unstoppable, uh, persecuting Jesus. So, uh, makikita natin sa Acts chapter 9, verse 3 to 5. Ang sabi dito, uh, Falling to the ground, he heard a voice saying to him, Soul, soul, why are you persecuting me? And who are you, Lord? Saul said, I am Jesus, the one you are persecuting. He replied, This is the word of God today. Glory to God. Hallelujah. So mga kapatid, Saul, uh, makikita natin sa scripture in chap Acts chapter 9 verse 3 to 5 na Saul was uh, uh, persecuted all the believers, the followers of Christ when that time. And then um, when he went to Damascus, before uh, close to the near uh, Damascus, Jesus appeared on him. So uh, uh, when, when he saw Jesus so bright and he became a blind so, so he become a, they said here that soul eyes have been blinded in physically. And I believe that this is the metaphor or talinghaga or a parable for his spiritual blindness in persecuting the Christians. So there's a lot of Christians under persecuted because of him. He killed them. And all that kind of innocent uh, Christian believers, the followers of Christ. So for three days, when after he met Jesus in the mass, close to the near in Damascus, and then for three days, mga kapatid, he need he need he need uh, he neither saw or nor ate or nor drank. So uh, Saul or Paul, uh, soul eyes have been blinded physically, and I believe. So, that this is a metaphor for his blindness, uh, uh, blindness and persecuting for the, for the Christians. So, for three days, so, hindi siya nakakita, hindi siya nakainom, or hindi siya makakain. So, again, um, so, I think of this as, this is time, in a tomb. So, parang pakiramdam niya, na, na ano, hindi siya nakakita, parang mahirap para sa kanya. Pero, uh, when, when he prayed, during this time, so he prayed and, and, and saw on, in a vision, in a vision, a man coming to him who, who would lay his hands upon him and give him back his, his sight. So, so now, Ananias was the man soul saw. So, isa siya. So, ito ang nakita niya sa vision niya. So, and God, Ananias, God asked Ananias to go to Saul. Needless to say, he was a reluctant. Reluctant means, uh, uh, nag-atubili siyang pumunta doon, puntahan si Paul. So, but he did do as the Lord asked and Saul received his sight. So, after he prayed, he prayed for him. So, he rose, he rose, and then he arise, and then, and then they, uh, ayan, then they, he gave uh, baptized. He baptized him and then he ate and then he drank and then the strength he was straightening that time kasi bumalik na yung lakas niya. So, gumaling na siya. So, nakakita na siya. So, once he had come to know Jesus, to begin to proclaim Jesus as the Son of God. So, sa diyang ano, na he was converted to Christ, he knew Christ, he became, uh, he became the followers of Christ. Then, um, he, um, he was uh, proclaimed, uh, Jesus is the Son of God. So, in, I'm sure that you can understand why the Christian in the area were afraid of him and didn't believe his transformation. So, Paul, or Paul became the apostle to the Gentiles and who him and without him we would have so much uh, so much uh, less knowledge uh, of the early church and the teaching persons so uh, when that time when they know that even they know that uh, Paul was changed and he was converted and he was become of the followers of Christ Takot na takot ang mga taong yun, mga, mga other followers, kasi 
ano, kilalang kilala si Paul kung ano ang ginagawa niya noon. So, yun mga kapatid, so takot na takot sila. But, even God transformed and changed his uh, character, his life, and then became the followers of Christ. Takot pa rin sila. Nag-alinlangan pa rin sila. Wala pa rin silang tiwala kay Paul. So, I wonder sometimes why we can't believe that God can still change the heart of a person and bring or hear to faith. So, malimit sa atin mga kapatid, di ba? Kahit sa panahon ngayon, kahit alam natin na nagbabago na ang taong yun. So, we still judging that person. So, nangyayari yan mga kapatid. So, we still judging according kung anong mga nakaraan niya. Binibase pa rin natin yun mga kapatid. Pero hindi natin ano na ang Panginoon kaya niyang baguhin ang tao. Kahit gaano pa kasama ang tao yun. Amen? Glory to God. So, um, ano, God, His love, so, mabago ang taong yun. Tapos, when the time, so, I think it may come from a desire for punishment of someone who has behaved badly. So, but we are not the judges of a person, hearts, that God's, God's, uh, that's the God's job, not ours, right? I, I, for one, I am happy to leave it to Him. I think, erase mga kapatid. So, yun. So, kaya nga sinabi doon sa Matthew chapter 7 verse uh, 1. Ano ang sabi? Na ano ng do not judge. So, we ano, do not, for, for the, do not judge so that you may not be judged. So, and then sabi din niya sa second, sa verse uh, chapters, uh, Matthew chapter 7 verse 2, na for the judgment you give will be the judgment you get. So, and the measure you give will be the measure for you, for a uh, measure you get. So, kung ano pala ang ating, kung nag-judge tayo sa ating kapwa, ganun din ang ating makukuha. So, ganun din ang ating marireceive. So, kung, so, kung ano yun, ang, ang, ang ginagawa natin, yun din ang ma-harvest natin, yun ang maaani natin. So, kung magtanim tayo ng kabutihan, makakatanggap tayo, makaka-harvest tayo ng, na makaka-receive tayo ng mabuti. Kasi mabuti ang itinanim natin. So, ganun mga kapatid. Kaya, huwag kayong magsihatol upang huwag kayong hatulan. Yun ang sinasabi sa Matthew chapter 7 verse 1. So, we have to be aware. We have to be careful as a believers. Even we know Christ. So, we need to be careful. We watch for kung ano ang kilos natin. Kung ano ang, ang ugali natin. Dapat, we don't, we don't judge para hindi tayo maahatulan ng Panginoon. Amen. Glory to God. So, yun mga kapatid, mga reminding ko. So, so yun ano ng um, when that time that um, the people, the believers, so they were judging Paul. Ano, takot na takot pa din sila. Dahil sa mga ginawa ni Paul noon. So, hindi natin sila masisisi. At ganun din sa panahon natin ngayon. Malimit tayo kung makita natin ang taong yun. Kung ano ang mga history niya. Napakasama niya. Pero nagjajudge tayo. So, remember mga kapatid. As a believers, we need to be careful. Because remember, we are the light of the world like Jesus. We need to imitate the attitude like Jesus. We need to follow what Jesus are. Uh, his character. So Jesus has a compassion. He has a compassion to to how to handle, how to show the love to others. Kahit ano pa makasalanan yung taong yun. Pinakikisamahan pa rin niya. Naalala ko nung my scripture na nung ano nakikihalubilo si Jesus sa mga makasalanan. Tapos ano nang hinuhusgahan sinasabi ng mga mga tao nung panahon. Kahit yung mga mga kasa mga apostol niya mga mga ano not apostol mga disciples niya ang sabi bakit ano yung mga mga Jewish people sinasabi noong unang panahon na bakit siya nakikihalubilo sa isang makasalanan yung mga tax collector pero alam ni Jesus ang nasa isip nila ang sabi hin, tinawag siya para sa mga makasalanan hindi sa mabuti so that means that God uh, our Abba Father, our God, uh, sent His Son, He sent His only begotten Son in this world to come to save and to save for all those people have sinned. So, God called us. So, God has 
some purpose why he, he was sending his son, his only begotten son, that whoever believes in him should not perish, but have an everlasting life. So, dahil si Jesus, he's the only one, he's the only way and the truth and the life that no one comes to the Father except through Him. So, kung tayo ay manalig kay Kristo, na siya ay tagapagligtas natin, as He is our Savior, so, uh, we will be saved. So, magkaroon tayo ng pananampalataya na walang hanggan. Kung tayo, ang pananampalataya natin ay walang pag-alinlangan, ay ito talaga ay solid. So, mga kapatid, yun ang mga encouragement ko na we have to be careful sa ating nakikita. We have, we have to be careful kung ano sasabihin, lalabas sa ating bibig. Ang bibig natin, ang dila natin, napakali, napakaliit ito mga kapatid. Pero, pag ito'y nagsasalita, di ba? So, mahirap. So, we need to be careful mga kapatid. Yun lang po mga kapatid, ang mga encouragement ko sa bawat isa sa atin na we need to be careful. That we need to be watchful kung ano. Kasi we are the light of the world. Ang lahat, paano, paano maliligtas ang iba? Kung nakikita sa atin na tayo ay hindi pa rin na bago, ang attitude natin, naghuhusga tayo sa ating kapwa. Amen? Glory to God. So, ito yung sinasabi na unstoppable uh, persecuting uh, Jesus means that uh, the followers of Christ after He was ascended to heaven. So, uh, mga kapatid, so soul changing. Uh, he, he, he was uh, not only he was blinded uh, physically but also uh, pina, ano, talinghaga na siya ay blindness in spiritually because he was persecuting all the believers that time. Amen? Glory to God. So yun lang po mga kapatid. So uh, mga encouragement. So before we end this video or uh, let us up pray. If you have any prayer request, just write on the comments. Uh, babalikan ko yan mamaya. I-include ko sa mga prayer list ko every day. Thank you so much for watching and thank you for all your support this ministry. Hallelujah. Pasensya na po. Paputol-putol yung ano ko, yung yung uh, video ko. So, draft of keeping draft of. So, ito mga kapatid, let us pray. Hallelujah. So, Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Loving God, you want all your children to be with you in heaven. You give us opportunities to come to know and believe in you. Let us not be suspicious of those who came to who come to you later in their journey, but be grateful that we have that we have come to know of your love at an early age. Hallelujah. Glory to God. O Abba Yahura Basiti Karakanda Rabasiya. We left after you, O God. Lord, hallelujah, help us, O God that we can rely on your faithfulness help us lord to more focus to you help us lord how our attitude to change to be transformed by the power of the holy spirit because we know that everything is not impossible to you O god thank you for sending your son lord jesus as a savior as a savior of the world and your compassion, your love, and never change, O God, because you are the Alpha and the Omega, the same yesterday, today, and tomorrow, and your love never change, O God, your unconditional, and unconditional love for your people. Thank you, Abba Yahoo. Thank you, Yahusha, Masiya Adonai. Thank you, Roha, Kudis, Rabasuto, Karakan, Ayere City, Korokanda, Rababasiya. I pray for all the people watching this video, O God. I pray for all the bloggers, hallelujah, that you bless them, O Lord, to know more close to you, Lord, to more embracing to you, O God. To know you, to recognize who you are, O oh God. I pray for all whole the nation to bring peace, O oh God. Lord, even in spite of trials and tribulation in our life, even in time of troubles and compromising in this world, Lord, help them, Lord, to overcome it. 
Help them to come to return back to you, Lord Jesus. Oh, give them an undivided, undivided heart that they may fear your name, O God. O Rabasiti Karakanda Rababakahiriki Tukunda Rabasia. O Rababasakanda Rabatikanda Rabasia. Kung sino man a Lord nagkasakit. If somebody, anybody, O Lord Jesus, hallelujah, have sickness. Oh, I pray in the name of Yahushua, Messiah, Adonai. Oh, Rabba Siti Karakhan, Rabba Kantikanda. Lord, bring healing, oh Lord, Rabba Siti Karakhan. Oh, Rabba Siya, because you was wounded for your transgression, for our transgression. You was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon you, Lord Jesus. And by your stripe, they will recover, oh God. Oh, we pray for those people, different kind of sickness, oh God. Cancer, cancer of the bone, cancer of the blood, cancer of the lungs, cancer of the 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 liver, and all kind of God harabasiti karakan kidney transplant, O Rabasia, kidney failure, O God, in the name of Yahushua, Masih Adonai. Lord, touch their kidney, O God. Restore, Lord, give them a brand new kidney, O God. Give them a brand new heart, O God. Those people have problem of the heart problem. In the name of Yahushua, Masih Adonai. Heart enlargement, O Rabakanti Kanda, na maging normal ang kanilang puso, O God. In the name of Yahushua, Masih Adonai. O Rakinti Kandara babasia, lang Lord, lang problem. Ura basia pneumonia. Ura basiti karakan broken bones. O God. Ura basiti karakan dara basia. I problem. Ura basiti karakan dara babakan pikanda. Oh Lord Jesus, labor problem. Ura basuto karakan dara basia. Blood problem. Ura basia anemia, anemic insomnia. Oh anxiety, depression. Ura basiti karak. Can restore, O oh God, to overcome, O oh God, mentally health, O oh God, anxiety, Alzheimer's, O oh Rabasia, dementia, O oh Rakayere, Sutukara, Kanda, Rababasia, heal your people, O oh God, heal them, O oh God, Rabasiti, Karakanda, Rabasia, O oh relationship, broken family, O oh God, restore, O oh God, in the name of Yahushua, Masia, Adonai, whatever, Lord, all our brothers and sisters around the world, all the missionaries around the world, oh God, provide the straightening to them under trials and persecution and trials, tribulation, of oh God, every family, oh God, restoration, oh God, Lord, hallelujah, rababa sanda, rababa kanti kanda, rababa haya, rakanti kundu, rababa shiti kura kanda, rababa siya, Lord Jesus, help them, help them, Jesus, Oh, Rabba, can show them the way, O oh God, to know who you are, to know to follow your ways, O oh God, not our ways, because your ways is best than our ways, O oh God, Rabba, Siti, Karakanda, Rabba, Siya. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. We love you. And thank you for your word, the encouragement for your people today. We love you and we give glory and honor to you. Thank you so much, O oh, Rabba Siti Karakan. Thank you, Yahusha Masiya Adonai. Thank you, Ruha Kudis Abba Yaho. Melik Haulam. O Baruch Ata Adonai. Elohino Melik Haulam. Elohino Han Melik Haulam. Melik Hakabud. Melik Hamilak Im Zamarti Halal Rabba Kanti Kanda. O Yara Siti Kura Hayera Baba Kanyiti Kundu. Andere baby yuro ko hayara kanda ra kanti kundere santa kanda ra baba siti karakan. Andere baby hira kanda ra baba santi kanda ra baba suntura kanda ra baba suyara tanda ra bahia. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen and amen. Glory to God. Thank you, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Um, thank you so much and see you next time. See you soon. May the Lord bless you. Shalom.